Hey, welcome to Pause on Purpose. So glad you joined us. Hey, this is going to be a great week. Um, I'm dressing a little casually because I've invited you to come join a virtual cabin with me for one week. These are up in the mountains of Alaska. Uh, we have a toasty fire, warm food, hot chocolate, coffee, tea, whatever you need to kind of warm up from the cold sleigh trip coming in. But you and I are going to be on a journey this week. And I, I hope you're packed and ready for an exciting journey, what God has for us for the next five days. We are going to be reviewing together our 2022. And we're going to be going through uh, basically five words that will help us review. Uh, there are many, many different methods of doing this. There's no right way. But here's the way that I thought would be good for us. We're going to replay the year. And I, I'm not going to ask you to remember every little detail. I'm going to ask us to ask God to remember those details and bring them into our memory. Then we're going to rejoice over those things that God did through and in us. Then we're going to review and uh, repent or turn around and say, Lord, here's where I missed you. Here's where some things I need to be redirected on. And it's not a shame game. It's just a redirection. And then we'll uh, reconcile. And what I mean by that is we'll look at how God longs to be reconciled to us so then we can lead to the final. And that is to refocus for the new year. So these are the steps we're going to be going through and they will be healing steps along the way. We're going to, we're going to find some, maybe some calm waters like this river behind us, looking out over the bay window of our cabin, or we might find some white caps that we're going to have to hold on and say, wow, I forgot about that. But look what God did. So to begin, I'm going to start with scripture, of course, and I want us to join together in this pause on purpose passage, Psalm 139, starting in verse 9. David writes, if I take up the wings of dawn, which is a phrase of saying, even if I could travel at the speed of light, you know what that's like. The moment dawn breaks over the horizon, it goes from dark to light. He says, even if I could travel that far, and dwell in the remotest part of the sea. Even there, your hand will lead me, and your right hand will take hold of me. Let me just stop there. I was going to continue, but let me stop right there. This is going to be a great journey for these next five days. No matter where God leads us, no matter what he brings into our lives and our memories, know this, our Lord is there to guide us. It's nothing to be afraid of. He is going to take us on this journey step by step, and he's never going to leave us. He's never going to forsake us. So I tell you what, call somebody today. Ask them to be your retreat partner. Come on up to the cabin in Alaska with me. Let's join this journey as we review 2022 and ask God to meet and prepare us. Review the year. What did God do in and through you? What were the good things? Where did we encounter God? And ask him to identify those areas that we actually did encounter God, but we, but we missed it. And that's okay. That's okay. But ask him to identify those areas that he actually intervened. We saw it. We can review it. So tomorrow, we can take the next step. In the meantime, go with God. Because, you know, he goes with you. Take care, beloved.